Hello everyone and welcome to Full Stack Devlogs. Today we will talk about updating the version of Node-RED. Recently in uh, July 2021, Node-RED has been updated to the 2.0 release, which is a major release and we will understand about all the things that are useful for us or new for us or very exciting to be used. We will start knowing about them one by one in different videos. This video will talk about how to update, what are the steps to update. After updating, we will be exploring the Monaco text editor, which we will try to grasp here. How are we going to change the editor theme? By default, Node-RED JavaScript editor works on the ACE editor, but we will be changing it to Monaco. We have to do it in the settings.js file. So let's begin. So now we simply uh, follow this. So we use the sudo npm install and minus g and save per node-red command to safely upgrade to the latest of node-red which we can see that the latest right now as of the moment is 206 so let's try and do it so now we can simply start the node-red global npm package that we have on our machine and see if we are upgraded from the version 129 to the latest 206 So yes, we see this, that Node-RED version 206 has already loaded up on the port 1881. And as we see here, this version is up and running here. Let's try to see what difference it makes. And here we see that still the kind of uh, JavaScript editor we are getting is a plain ACE enabled, the ACE editor, right? Like for example, if I do msg dot, I don't get any any suggestions here, and the code pretty much looks like a notepad and pretty much basic. Now let's try to upgrade it to the Monaco theme and see how the Monaco editor works with new upgraded version of Node-RED. So now we can simply see that to enable the Monaco text editor in the editor theme inside the settings.js file of your Node-RED, the running Node-RED version that you have. First, I will stop uh, stop the running node server. So this is the code which is running as per my server distribution, and here I can easily change the editor theme and pass the new code editor property and set it to Monaco. Now here I will simply restart my server. You remember the ACE editor which you are using right now. So our version is 206. We see that it doesn't run. Why? Because we are doing it the wrong way. We are passing it inside the projects, which is wrong. And this is a mistake. What we have to do is we have to pass code editor as a different property make it work again and here you see that the Monaco editor is up and running so here if I want to do message I get all the so here is like the topic and also I can access all the node red runtime features also like this as you see now I can call the red dot util and call any functions of the following so that's it about uh, the Monaco editor and updating the node red in the next video we will see that how we will take advantage of the next beautiful feature that we are going to enable which is the most needed for any developer and it is the flow debugger. So let's hunt it down in the next video. For connecting to me in more different ways, you can log into my website gaurdasgupta.com. I will pass on my URL in the description. Feel free to go through and feel free to connect. Thanks for your time. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. 
थैंक यू सो मच सी यू अगेन